Hi all, it's Terhi here. Uh, I haven't been posting any videos for a while as I had a quite massive uh, knee surgery in the beginning of March. So now I try to be back on track and scrapbooking and doing videos and everything like normal living. Um, this layout is made with March hip kits and it tells a fun story about my studio, which is not a studio, it's a part of floor in our apartment. Um, we, uh, as I don't have any studio space, no studio room, nothing like that, I do my videos on the floor. It might sound a bit weird since I had a problem with my knee, but uh, I'm doing it still because I love scrapbooking and doing these videos, so I'll manage it. Anyway, that's a story behind this layout, and uh, I decided to use a lot of Pink Fresh Studio products on this layout. These are mostly from the um, March main kit, but some are from March embellishment kit. and. I think one of the stickers switch uh, is from the Project Life kit, but anyway, all are from Pink Fresh Studio, which I adore, and I decided to use the American Crafts Dear Lizzie uh, Lovely Day papers with the Pink Fresh Studio products because they are both uh, going together so perfectly. Uh, I am using the striped paper on the background and then I'm using this uh, flourish paper on top of it and I did some die cutting to make more flowers from the shimmel paper and then I'm repeating the stripe spot in another direction uh, with this striped paper. Not a very wise sentence, but anyway, you get the point. Um, at this point, the layout uh, looks quite, how to say it, too light for me. So I decided to have something more dark to the layout. Uh, first, I'm adding just this title first. It's a sticker, but I want to add some dimension. So I'm adding some dimension by using 3D foam. And now I'm wondering what kind of dark things I'm going to use for this layout to add some kind of contrast to somewhere. And I decided to add these uh, dark blue stripes of the same florist paper. Um, I'm just adding this double-sided tape and then adhering it to the white cardstock. Um, I'm not adding a lot of mixed media to this page because, as, as I said, uh, the layout is really light already and these are the contrasting parts of the page and I don't want to mess it around. Pink Fresh, Pink Fresh Studio products are really light and really modern looking and I don't want to ruin them at all. I want to show the best of them. So that's why I'm keeping this layout really simple and showcasing the Pink Fresh Studio products. I don't know about you, but I think our styles with scrapbooking are always changing and I feel that my style is right now going to the um, fresh and not so mixed media style right now, but it might be another thing after month <laughs> of this video, uh, because sometimes the products just leads the way, like in this layout. Uh, I really want to play with those Pink Fresh Studio stickers and they are like yelling for me, use me, use me, and I'm like, okay, okay, I'll try, I'll try. And then this happens. Not a lot of mixed media, just few flicks of mist and that's it. But then again, uh, I already did a layout for next week and that includes a lot more of mixed media. There is some stencil work, there is more 
use of uh, mists and then I did another project which is full of everything there's like million layers of different medias and stuff like that but anyway the style of each of us is always changing and it's kind of fun thing to watch when we go through the albums and made layouts and so you can see that oh this was the part when I always used like uh, let's say I always use the mist on every layout by spraying it and then I decided to use it another way and then there's 10 layouts of using the same same technique of some products anyway probably you get the point uh, style is changing and that's a good thing and yeah so uh, I'm decorating this page with these lovely uh, puffy stickers I'm adding a little bird here which is saying happy thoughts well uh, scrapbooking for me is really all about happy thoughts so it really fits here perfectly uh, I'm adding some leaves here, it, the puffy stickers are giving some nice texture. Uh, I'm al also using these leather stickers, which are doing the same trick. They are giving another texture for the pa page and it's really nice. I'm thinking if I'm adding something more, but no. If I add some more words, but no. Then I decided to add some of these nice golden stickers which were in um, February hit kits I think these were in main kit but anyway I decided to add these little stickers here and now the mixed media part of this page which, which is really small it's just few flicks of mist and that's it the layout is really simple and fresh and nice fresh as pink press studio but anyway I hope you liked it and I hope you are inspired and yeah so we'll see you again next week week with another layout very different kind of layout but anyway we'll see you back then and thank you for watching bye